Dear brothers and sisters, campaigners, all those of you who are struggling for justice, uh, I want to talk to you because we are just around the corner from Shah of Ramadan and it's got only weeks before we reach it. Uh, the barakah is going to be unleashed on us, but in the same time we need to rise up to our responsibility. Ramadan, again, we will be consuming large number of dates, amount of dates, and I want to talk to you about Israeli dates, the occupiers date. Uh, you know that there is something in the region of 151 million pounds of export from Israel regarding dates. And Britain uh, receives around 23 million pounds of that. These dates are coming to your supermarkets, they're coming out through uh, different companies. There is a leaflet here actually highlights all the companies that actually sell Israeli dates. And indeed, in your supermarket, you could go and you could pick up Majula dates and you see that most of them, 90% of them, are from Israel. When you see that, put it down immediately. Don't buy it. Don't buy dates which has been stolen and used, a stolen land from the Palestinians, and it's actually you cannot really break your fast with it. So there is alternative all the time. But also, I want to highlight something very important. There is still time now. Go to your shops, go to your corner shops and actually make sure that none of these dates are actually sold there. Those who are labeled are very easily exposed. But what they're doing, and there's a trickery going on here to con our community, and that is that you could find a box of Majula dates with a name like Jordan Majula dates or Jordan Valley or Jordan this or anything else or with some Arabic words on it but when you look at it and examine it you see that there is no country of origin on it this is actually illegal this is against trading standards uh, standard and indeed tell those shops that they should remove it and if they complain that they can't report them to the trading standards because this is illegal and if they say that no I already bought it and there is nothing I can do no there is something you can do you could send it back because you shouldn't have been sold this at the first place let us make sure that we will not buy Israeli dates but also we could go one step further there are dates that are 100% Palestinian these are Zaytun dates and Yaffa dates these are 100% Palestinian resources from this, goes to the Palestinian community, and we could break our fast and help the Palestinians at the same time. Let us make sure that this Ramadan, we remember the oppressed Palestinians and help them, and we will not give a penny to the Zionist entity who is oppressing them. Also, what I would like you to do is to make sure that this video goes viral, goes everywhere. Use your Twitter, use your Facebook, use your contact. Make sure everyone hears about this. Let us make sure together this year we stop any pennies going to the Zionists to help and support them. And in same time, we support our Palestinian brothers. Ramadan Mubarak to all of you.